An example of a successful experimentation project is the UHAC, an ultra heavy lift amphibious connector. We'll also be able to scale over obstacles such as seawalls with ease. There will be three categories of experiments, fleet force experiments, technology conop experiments, and lab level experiments. Fleet force experiments will demonstrate cutting edge technologies and capabilities. For instance, autonomous swarm boats with its sensors and software will enable swarming capability, giving naval warfighters a decisive edge. Technology concept of operation or CONOPS experiments. We'll explore the use of new technologies to conduct existing CONOPS more efficiently, like the XFC fuel cell powered long endurance UAS. Or halo port barriers, easy to maneuver into place with extraordinary stopping power. plus the UM2RS, a rapidly deployable, cost-effective unmanned system which will extend fast attack boat support, anti-piracy operation support, and disaster assessment. Lab-level experiments conducted to exploit aspects of technology concepts to answer feasibility questions, like the robotic snake, a robotic tool for inspection and remediation of fleet piping. The slithering robots can snake through a pipe-like environment without a human operator and are equipped with a light and video camera to capture their surroundings. Or the micro-optic low-light imager, bringing the capabilities of night vision goggles into lightweight glasses. The Office of Naval Research offers the connections to experimentation. ONR is using experimentation to better build the future force. Thank you.